Okay, my friends, I want to be very, very detailed about this stuff. Um, very, very important it is. This, for this clip here, the only thing I want you to see is the date right there, April 19th of 2019. Uh, stuff here happening so fast that uh, you don't get to trace at all things about what's going on, okay? Um, it's very important for me to be very, very detailed about this stuff. Yeah, you can already hear coughing. It is very important. Uh, basically, it's like this. Okay, uh, this was filmed on April the 19th already because it was... What was it? Thursday... I think well, when I realized it was a Thursday or Friday when I think I realized what was happened within a week but I cannot say that this was done within a week to me um, I believe that both peers the newer peers were destroyed uh, in the very same day. The only thing is that I did not walk around with uh, or change shoes, uh, you know, that week. So I would not know exactly where each pair of these shoes was destroyed. I believe they were destroyed um, on the same day. I don't think they would probably even go and do the stuff like this, you know, vandalize stuff like this once and then do it again and so on. I believe that they were destroyed within the same day um, and now let me go and explain everything in details oh yeah coughing this is very important video this one we're gonna begin with what was under MK Ultra <clears throat> if you're gonna use this um, to clean the shoes we will destroy you uh, all the shoes even if you would you should not even use this in fact is what I was taught under MK Ultra because if you will use this uh, the only thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go like this along the edges and it's gonna eat your fabric everything it's gonna be finished like that um, this is just a plain fact the thing is that I did use this but I did use this in an intelligent way. I use this only to clean uh, like this side. So the shoes would look nice and presentable because it's a lot of uh, sand, dust type of environment here uh, in this part of the Poland. Okay, this we're going to square away immediately. Uh, if I would have used this thing here, um inappropriately the shoes would have been destroyed already i don't know maybe <clears throat> nine months ago or something like this eight months ago because i have used this thing repeatedly i have to say i'm not ashamed to say that i have not used one the only thing was that i used this in an intelligent way i would not go and place this thing on fabric um whether they have used this thing to cause damage, it's possible. Um, I got very upset when I saw this thing, and I, what you have seen was recorded over, the voice recorded over, because I have blamed the roommate Yuri for everything, because he provocated me about, I would say, maybe a month ago, with the issue on how do I know that Hassan destroyed me everything like and so on since I didn't have proofs since I don't have a video recorded him and shit like this crazy stuff like this um, and so because he is the only person who's got a keys from this room and evidently does not lock one when he exits the room or night or whatever it is the only time he locks himself is basically when he is by himself inside of the room 
um, because of the relationship he had with the Hassan, basically protecting him and so on, they are on the same page. I did attribute it, this damage to him. No, Hassan is gone already for I don't know how long now. Uh, I don't know, maybe three weeks or whatever. And so it would make sense to attribute this uh, as much to him as to the present Belarus roommate with whom I already was in the same room with the Hassan. But that might not necessarily be the case. Um, a knife specialty, a cutting, was a specialty of the Hassan. Um, in a final stage, it does not even matter whether he did or Hassan did, it doesn't make any difference. The two are on the same page and three pairs of shoes are destroyed. That is really what matters here. Uh, um, it started like this. These are the oldest shoes I have used. These are the oldest. They're not so old. I bought this, basically got with both of these pairs of shoes, new pairs of shoes here to Poland. Almost new pairs of shoes. I brought them from Slovenia. Um, started to use them and well, they're not even so worn out. They are worn out, but you know, I think there is some extra stuff that has been done to them. Um, I'm going to explain to you exactly what was done to them because I very, very diligently I have followed the whole situation. What you see here was not done by me, this thing here, and who knows, maybe that liquid was done. This thing, what you see here, was done to the shoes about, I estimate, maybe two months ago when another Chechen family was here, and this was a very close friend of Hassan. He had um, two families he worked with. Both of those families are gone now. They disappeared. I was told they are already in, I don't know, in Germany and stuff like that. It's a BS. They're right here in Poland. I can tell you that too. Um, this thing here that you see here was done by... I have no idea what this thing was done. Um, it could have been done probably with that thing right there that you see it. Uh, the first thing, however, that was done to the shoes, and it was like this. The guy would walk inside of the room two months ago in front of me and Hassan and would start to express the interest in my shoes. And so I mentioned him. I said, these are, these are really good shoes. I recommend you these shoes. They are just 50 zloty, like 12, 13 euros. You can go buy yourself these shoes in Decathlon and they're going to last you long. And they're really good shoes for a very little money. Buying used shoes can give you some serious problems on legs. Uh, there's all types of all forms of um, glivets, um, you know, stuff I'm talking about. Um, the next thing you see within maybe just two, three days, okay, was... Let me see this thing here. Was this thing here that appeared? And this thing was done. This was done undoubtedly with the knife. So this was like a sign to me. We saw your shoes, and this is what the case is now. Then There was no this thing here that you see on this side. There was nothing on this side here. Let me just see something else. Um, but look at this thing here. There was none of this here that you see. There was like uh, like this. 
like a little thing like this a hole it was and it was not related to this thing here there was the shoes were not like brand new shoes they did have a hole um, let me just see <clears throat> this is how it was basically done and the only thing I would do is after I saw this thing here the only thing I would do is I would place these shoes by the way it was without this thing here that you see like this the only thing I would do it was like this the only thing I would do is I would use these shoes for interior just here for the you know for the room so I would not I would keep things clean whatever as much as I could M most of the time I forget to use them anyways uh, but I don't forget to clean the room but what happened was a lunatic Hassan got idea that he did not cause enough damage and it is completely evident it cannot be even be hidden this thing here that what you see here this is completely fresh type of again this is how he continued he 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 um if he was the one and i think he was the one i don't think this belarus guy would go and do this is like a low life type of shit you would do stuff like that that you gotta be a little bit ticked in the head you gotta be a little bit sick in the head you gotta be sick in the head to the point that you actually believe that you see yourself uh see in your madness that things of someone are just falling apart because you wouldn't do the shit like this unless you would believe firmly into your illusion literally he continued with this shit here and you can see this thing here yeah this thing was not even ever um you know if if cleaned afterwards because they're still the way they were as i stopped using them i would not use them anywhere i would just use them right here so what he did here i don't know maybe he used that liquid or something like this but in my opinion what he did was he went with a knife and he caused cuts and cuts and cuts and he did this to the shoes and probably in final stage he would use that thing as well and just go over and over and over and have connected what was on the this side what you see here this all like this he connected one with this thing here and so on and so forth so he caught he just went like mad and he started to destroy the shoes totally so we went from this thing here that was only and like i said it was like this we went from this thing here to basically what you see right there that was one pair of shoes that was done first a month ago and what you see here this kind of a stuff this i do not know this stuff might have been done maybe about a week and a half ago maybe something like this um the bottom line is that when you have stuff like this uh, that means that these are the shoes you no longer you can wear them at all okay when you have a stuff like this it means that it's finished it's over with the shoes they're finished pretty much they're done with um interesting is maybe to note that these are like white shoes and maybe that's why he wanted to do it somehow in his way so that somebody would say maybe a police officer or this have you used this thing or something like this and voila there you go i believe this is what his theory would be anyways these are one pairs of shoes oh let me see this one here these are close to new pairs of shoes these are like new pairs of shoes totally new this is like 
I bought these shoes. I don't know. I bought this sometimes in November, I think I did. But it was a winter time, so I wouldn't even go much out. Uh, and I would not use these shoes almost at all. If I would use, I would use preferably these shoes, which are still good. And keep the shoes as much as possible intact. Um, would maybe go a few times only to zgirge with them. Not many times at all. But this is what alarmed me because those are old shoes. I wasn't going to use them really for anything else than interior. Maybe even for the shower if I had to. But now I see the shoes that <clears throat> you can see the shoes that they never ever were even cleaned with that type of stuff. You can see these shoes now already now you can see them, I don't know, destroyed here. You can see them You can see them here basically cut with a knife because this is a plain knife cut right here that you see it. Now this I gotta do it with the precision. Well, this is why this is very important to record now. So it can be seen. You can see that clearly that... Uh, let's see this. This clearly is a knife cut. This is not. This is not a damage that would be done. There is a plastic on both sides. Basically, you can clearly see it. And what the guy did is he took the knife and he went right through this material here with a knife, which. Even if you would use probably that thing, probably if you would, would not <laughs> penetrate here just like this, it would probably, uh, most likely, it would go through fabric uh, elsewhere. It would go first, but that's just not the case. The fabric is like completely new. Okay. And let's see, what else can we find here on these shoes here? This here, I got to say, this is already doubtful from my side. It might have been that he already started to, to use something. Folks, these shoes are very cheap. But I can assure you, because I have used them since 2017, the first shoes I bought were in Belarus. These shoes are freaking tough. They are very good, very cheap, uh, long lasting. Uh, no different than Nike that you buy for 40 euros, a regular Nike. No, everything else is intact. The only thing is a knife damages. Now, yes, I did. I do have a crack here. And this crack is because I did step on a glass. When on a near property, there was a glass. And I st stepped on this thing. And it cut. It did a cut. But I did some super glue here. And it's like, it's nothing. It just looks like there was a crack otherwise it's just as firm as solid as everywhere else is okay i have the other pair here so when you have a new shoe like this already cut like this, that's when it spurred alarm in me. 
Ah, look at that. Uh, it's already here some kind of a funny shit here that, that is also started to appear. Meaning that very likely the guy is using something like this to cause damage to me. You know, this is very easy actually to prove because these shoes, like I said, these shoes are like a new, they barely were used. And if I would be doing the shit like this with other shoes, uh, they would not last me a very long time, you know. But in quite opposite I have to say that if I would be doing this stuff like this um, I don't know I have been here for like a nine months um, and I didn't have this kind of issue uh, the first shoe like I said was destroyed two months ago and I believe I actually have a video recording of the shoe when that damage was done to it so I will find that video recording most likely and we'll use that as a platform for everything I have stated since the shoes afterwards when they were open like this were never used none of this stuff existed it was just done like this and probably to portray me that maybe just lately I have used this or maybe that I'm just so fucking crazy that I have been using this for a very long time which would also not make any sense because if I would be using this for a very long time in uh, in appropriate manner, I am sure I would not be so fucking crazy that I would not realize with two other pairs of shoes that this is the stuff I shouldn't do. So this is beyond any doubt proven case. It's not so easy to just go and omit and just to create, uh, you know, destruction of the property to someone uh, just like this and get away with it in imagination it is but in a practice it's not so easy to do that mm, I guess this is gonna do it for the new pair of shoes and now this pair of shoes this is the older pair of shoes which was practically yeah you see this thing here this is as an example i will give you the type of damage i had on the other pair of shoe like this but i have to say the other pair of damage the, the first one the oldest one was a little bit more evident the whole now what you see here the only thing you would have to do is basically use that by the way this and those are the same age they are the same old they came at the same time from slovenia so when you see this thing here when you see this pair of shoes and when you see that pair of shoes that you are about to see now okay so the pair of shoes that was totally destroyed and this pair of shoes here they are the same age they are the same age this is the same age the same time was in use everything the same thing so you see if you would connect something you would just go and paint i guess this area here with that thing right there then maybe you could cause some kind of a damage like this um but this is how it panicked me you know look at this thing here again look at this um this again was done in a hurry because we have again fabric here and i'm pretty sure this was done at the same day we have again fabric here on both sides just like we have a leather before that was cut with a knife on both sides 
you see he probably did pour some liquid that kind of stuff on it but still that liquid did not eat everything here on the bottom you can still see the fabric so he used the knife to to cause as much as damage as possible and probably then what he would do is he probably would use some liquid or whatever he used to cause this kind of shit so these are these are basically you're talking about two pairs of shoes destroyed like within a week within one week and i believe it was the same day and it pisses me off because yuri said well you know how do you know that he did you don't have the proof well, i don't fucking know i should just take socks and shoes i think i should walk around with them and that probably at night i would lock them and then i would know right because if i leave them inside of this room they are safe of course i mean this is the logic that you know i am around and it's something i should just go on with it become acceptable then within his uh, imagination this is also new stuff he would go and he would do some more stuff like this but this is the same shit like he did with the socks basically the guy's mad uh again these are the same shoes the same age the same thing where i don't see any kind of damage like he did on the other pier and so if i would be doing this kind of stuff uh with that liquid right there or something like this it probably would appear on both shoes but it did not okay Uh, we got again the same kind of thing here the same type of stuff we have here um no the shoes are not new but important part is that what you see here the damage you see it here doesn't have nothing to do with here with this thing here on the top compared to this one here this is like down on the bottom this is like completely new and it's what he tried to present on the other pier like you know you would do you would use some kind of liquid to basically destroy your shoes something like this like for instance here this kind of stuff totally artificially created shit Oh, this is how he connected the tanks together whatever and most likely he did this with the liquid but anyway let's go back here and finish this tank here so no damage like this nothing like this the same age of shoes but he did make sure that this thing here looks like this and then in his imagination he went a little higher and he did a little bit like this what he does he takes a knife and he goes like this and he's scratching this thing a little bit paint and so on and so now what's gonna happen is i'm basically without the shoes i don't have the three pairs of shoes that i have like this me being a complete idiot three-year-old boy i am i don't know ten-year-old boy i am I am now without shoes because he went ahead and he cut three pairs of shoes. Let me see if he did some more stuff here. Um, under MK Ultra, they played with this kind of stuff. They play with this kind of stuff. There was Americans that would not have shoes. There was one guy uh, in 
Zgirsh, that was all pissed off. Look what I got. It's because of you. It's because of you. And wanted me to feel sorry for him under MKL. Try and laughed at him instead. You know, because of me. Like, I mean, come on. Um, this is just a situation. Like I said, it started two months ago. Uh, when the damage was done, what you have seen, the family moved out. But I believe that within one week ago, one and a half week ago, on the same day, somebody played with these shoes badly. And if it's not my roommate Yuri, which I'm pretty sure he is not, 100% however he knows who did it. That is actually what matters. When you witness, when you see who does the shit like this, it doesn't make any difference whether you did or you did not because you did not report this stuff. That's what matters. Yeah, but it would be wrong if I would say that he did. So I just want to be really technical about that kind of stuff.